Do you have one of those PDP light up switch docks? If not, buy one now because what you're about to see is amazing. Hello everyone, my name is Adam and welcome to Time Lag Gaming. Make sure to stick around for the whole video because you are going to love what I have to show you. If you don't know, this is the PDP light up switch dock shield officially licensed by Nintendo. You put your switch dock on top of this and then slide in a clear plate with a design on it. Then, the entire panel gets lit up, which illuminates the design on it. The dock features multiple colors that you can manually select to your desire. There are also different modes. You can have it as a solid color, you can have it fade in and out, or fade between colors. You can purchase the dock in one of two configurations. There is a Pokemon bundle that comes with a Pikachu plate and a Pokeball plate. Or, you can get the Mario and Zelda bundle that comes with a plate inspired by Mario Odyssey and Breath of the Wild. Both of these are solid bundles and they look amazing. However, the one problem is PDP doesn't sell additional plates, so you're just stuck with the two plates that came with it. If you watch Kevin Kenson's video about him trying to make his own DIY custom plates for this dock, you'll know that it's super hard and no matter what, it doesn't turn out very well. However, Axel Monel makes and sells these custom plates for the PDP light up dock on his Etsy page, CO2 Studio. He charges $13 per custom plate with free shipping to the US and there are 27 designs you can choose from. Just look at all these designs you can choose from. They are so beautiful. I will have links down in the description so you can purchase the PDP light up dock accessory and a link to where you can buy these custom plates. So don't forget to check out the description. Just to note, when you're watching this, he may be out of stock, but he makes them often, so check back frequently for when he has more in stock. Now, I actually bought three plates from him, and I have them right here, so let's take a look. I ordered one with the Nintendo logo, and then two custom ones with my logo. He also threw in a free Smash Ultimate inspired plate, so thank you very much for that. Your order comes with a microfiber cloth to help you keep your plates clean, and it also comes with a little paper with instructions. Before you can use it, you have to take off a protective film on one side. And honestly, I have to say, it can be very hard to take these off at first, but I'm glad he included this film to help protect the custom plates. Each plate slides in perfectly. The fit is exact and snug, so you know they won't be coming out unless you take them out yourself. As you can see, he has his branding with his logo and Instagram account on the bottom, which actually looks good, but don't worry, when you put the plate into the dock, that isn't visible at all. Each plate really looks amazing. I can't recommend these enough. One thing I noticed is that these custom plates actually light up better than the official ones. And these aren't the only designs you can choose from. Like I said before, he has 27 completely unique plates that you can choose from, and they are all stunning. He used to do custom requests, but he no longer does them right now, as they are too time consuming and he was getting tons of orders for them. But he graciously made two completely custom ones for me, since I had the PNG files for my logo. I'm really glad with how these plates with my logo turned out. It's really cool to have the channel logo lit up on the Switch dock. I also have an extra plate with my logo on it, and I'm not a huge fan of Smash Brothers, so I think sometime in the future I'll be doing a giveaway where you will have a chance to win these. So what do you think about these custom Switch plates? Do you already have one of these light up dock accessories? Will you be buying a PDP dock or one of these custom plates? Let me know your take in the comments down below. Thanks again for watching.